Today marks one year since a man was shot and killed on a West Palm Beach High School campus after crashing through the gates. Good evening, thanks for joining us. I'm Jay Jarvis. The suspect, a former Dreyfus School of the Arts student, nearly hit a staff member before being shot and killed by a West Palm Beach police officer. The Palm Beach County State Attorney recently ruled the officer did nothing wrong. But right now, friends and family are gathered outside the West Palm Beach Police Department demanding answers about how Roman Phelps died. Our Steve King joins us live outside the police department. And Steve, what are his family and friends stay, saying tonight? Jade, well, what they're saying is they want to know exactly why Roman Phelps had to be shot and killed when he crashed through the gates of Dreyfus School of the Arts on May 13th, 2022. As we take a look behind me, you can see his family and friends gathered right here on the steps of the West Palm Beach Police Department. Now, they went to his grave earlier in the afternoon before making their way here to the police department to make their voices heard. People close to Phelps say that mental health struggles led to what happened that day and Phelps never intended to hurt anybody. The Palm Beach County State Attorney recently determined that the officer who shot and killed Phelps did nothing wrong and no charges will be filed against that officer and no actions of any kind will be taken. Investigators say during that incident, Phelps endangered people at the school and fought with the officer who eventually shot him. The Palm Beach County State Attorney said in part in his letter to the West Palm Beach Police Chief, quote, judged from the perspective of a reasonable officer on the scene, the officer's use of deadly force was objectively objectively reasonable under the circumstances. Additionally, the officer was attempting to make a lawful arrest and as such had no duty to retreat. People close to Phelps at today's demonstration say they want the Palm Beach County State Attorney to reconsider that decision. We want to know what happened. We want to see footage. We want evidence of what, why my, why my, one of my closest friends is no longer on this earth, you know. And the Florida Department of Law Enforcement would be the agency to release that footage. The West Palm Beach Police Department says that the investigation, quote, speaks for itself. And the West Palm Beach Police Department also says that they do not support this demonstration. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.